You, Hamas declared today a day of rage, calling for global protests. Law enforcement across the nation ramping up their patrol efforts, despite there not being a specific targeted threat. Caleb Califano spoke with the Palm Beach County Sheriff about his efforts to keep everyone safe. So far, we've heard from a number of law enforcement agencies in our area. And here in the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office, they play a major role in making sure any threat like the one today is properly investigated. Sheriff Rick Bradshaw tells me they are the lead agency in South Florida's Fusion Center, a collaborative effort of state, local, tribal, territorial, and federal agencies who work together to prevent any threats in the area. It's a total South Florida effort. Uh, we, we know what's going on and gather information between here and Key West. Um, and, uh, you know, we're in constant contact with other sheriff's offices uh, in the region. Today, many agencies across South Florida and the country are on high alert. The reason why is because a former Hamas leader has named today a day of jihad, calling on Muslims to protest across the world to deliver a message of anger. Increased patrols won't just be focused on synagogues and temples, but all places of worship. It's not just targeted at the Jewish institutions. You know, we don't want somebody to come out here that is going to take this opportunity to do something against a mosque, uh, against the Catholic Church. Currently, Sheriff Bradshaw, as well as the Department of Homeland Security, says there's no specific or credible intelligence indicating a threat to the United States. Still, they are working to make sure everyone feels safe. They can feel comfortable that we're paying attention to the situation, that we have the necessary resources deployed, and they don't have to live in fear. Caleb Califano, WPBF 25 News.